Hi, Super Spruce here, back on Loach True Infinity Gamma video episode 5, and yeah, I can see I can attend, I'm just gonna do it right now. To see if there's anything new, there are some new stuff here. Um, I Unfortunately, I can't get any of these, so it looks like all I'm gonna do... Um, okay, Unfunity gets reset, but these upgrades don't get reset. That's actually a lot more crucial. I thought, I just heard that Unfunity resets. It's just the, the amount. I can actually, with two Eternity Points, I can get both Dimension 1 and Dimension 2. Dimension 3 also costs a single Eternity Point. So, that's pretty interesting. There may be some new automation. There's not a single new automation. Okay. Um, that, that's fine. I think what I'm what the goal is going to be is just try to get more on Funity Points. Because, yeah, I know, it's... It's very dumb. It's the same grind over again. At least I have these upgrades. I could try to grind all the way to 177,000. I mean, what I could do is I could look at these upgrades. So Union, double on fun becomes triple on fun. That would be huge because I have 10 levels of that. At 2 to that power, it would be um, 2 to the 10th, which is 1,024. You can see here. With triple, that would become about 55,000, actually almost 60,000, so I would like the 55 times boost of Unfunity. Not only that, it would make the scaling of this upgrade, because this, um, it scales by tripling the cost, it would make that really, really, it would make it even better. It'd make it so that Unfunity could inflate. At least, at least, at least quadratically, because this upgrade is exponential. But if I'm already getting exponential, then I can get this. This will give me an, another multiplier for it. So that's actually that's extremely powerful, especially if this is retroactive. I'm hoping it's retroactive, because if it wasn't at retroactive, I wouldn't get the 55 times boost initially. But yeah, I would, I would love it for to inflate. It'd be, it would be. Quadratic exponential. And then here, pairing unfunity upgrades don't consume unfunity points. That's pretty decent because when you consume the unfunity points, you have to wait for it to get back to the unfunity points. So that, or you have to get, wait for it to get back to where you were for any progression to happen. And this is unlock ordinals. Oh, there's a new mechanic. And then infinity is upgrades aren't reset on infinity. Okay, so. Yeah, these, these upgrades seem really good. The first one seems the best. I really, really, really want five Eternity points. I'm hoping the Eternity power is going to allow me to get five. Because, yeah, if it doesn't, I, I would. I don't want to grind all the Unfunity again. So, I'm probably going to just do a huge Unfunity grind. Like, even at this point, it takes, um, yeah, over three hours of of online playtime to get this upgrade. So, yeah, that's that's quite a bit. And even if I do get the upgrade, if I want the next one after this, it would be um it would be times 3 half yeah, 3 halves, I think. So, that would be almost 5 hours. So, I I don't want to really grind all of that. So, I'm just hoping that I'm going to be able to get 5 this run. So, yeah. Also, I, I have I, I still have these upgrades. These actually are not reset, which is interesting. So yeah. Other than that, I think I'm just going to see in a bit. Okay, I'm back after grinding a lot off camera, just mostly on funity points. I mean, I can do the infinity points. I will be able to reach eternity, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to reach five eternity points. I'm not going to if I if I can't reach five eternity points. I'm just going to keep doing this run because I don't want to grind back all of the unfunity points. That would that, that would just be lame. I, I just want to get this upgrade ASOP so I can actually do stuff. So here is well enough infinity points for eternity. It's probably also enough to get this dimensional jump upgrade all the way to level 100. But there's not much I can do after that. Like all, I just need to grind unfunity points. You can see this goes up. It, you have to wait for every dimension. I think there's an upgrade. Um, yeah, there's there's definitely something here that should. Yeah, that definitely does something. But still, dimensions reset, and I have no idea how I'm gonna have to deal with that. But 
Well, it looks like we can gain three Eternity Points, but I'm guessing this is the same formula for Infinity Points. And it took a while to get four Infinity Points, much less five. And I think I'm going to need at least E900 Infinity Points to reach five Eternity Points. Like, you can see, even with all of this Infinity Points, I'm probably going to get basically nothing more than this. Um, than this E683. You can see, yeah, E684. I just need to grind more on Infinity Points. What I'll do is I, I will get this upgrade. Then I will get a super unfun upgrade after that, hopefully. I don't know. Just something that will, that will give me more Infinity Points so I can actually get more Eternity Points. So, or I could even, like, not buy this and just try to go straight to the five Eternity Points. That's actually a strategy. And it may actually be worth it, considering I'm guessing I'm going to need maybe 300,000 on Infinity Points. I'm, like, 60% of the way there. And if I do this, it's not going to be fast enough, like, to regain it as... Yeah, I'm just not going to get the upgrade, because it, it's just not going to be as fast to regain all the Infinity Points after I buy this. So, yeah, see you in another bit. Okay, I'm back, um, well, a while later. And I can finally gain five Eternity Points, but before I do that, I need to get these upgrades. So, yeah, I'm just going to get these... So I can do this, and Eternity for 5, Eternity Points. Please, no rounding errors. Okay, good, no rounding errors now. Yeah, I'm now producing 177,000 Unfunity Points per hour. It's actually, is that, that feels a little low. That feels like it should be higher than what it is. And this is now way more expensive. So unfortunately, there's no inflation. I don't really get why this didn't increase very much. It's, it's it's just the previous cost of the upgrade versus, well, th this seems to be, I'm not even sure what the cost scaling is, but yeah, this is not what I, was, I hope for. It's something, but it looks like I'm going to really need more stuff. Like, I'm, I probably want the unfundy upgrades don't consume unfundy points, and then just do a huge run. I mean, the thing is, it's already really slow, even with all of this. Actually, no, that's why. It's 8.86 E6 on Fundy Per Hour. That's, that's why I'm complaining. It's still a little slower than I thought. This, unfortunately, does scale, but I will be able to get a few potency upgrades, and this is actually much faster than what I previously have gotten. So, like, what was that? I was at, like, 270,000. I'm basically already back at 270,000, so... This is actually is the speed boost I was looking for, but imagine if I can just do this for an hour. That will give me a crazy amount of unfundy points. It will allow me to get a few of these upgrades and a few of these upgrades. Maybe even push me all the way to E250 Eternity Points. Who knows? So, yeah, seen a bit. Okay, I'm back, and I have a lot of unfundy points. It's enough to, well, get this many infinity points, which means this many eternity points. Which is crazy. This is what allows me to get all of the upgrades. This one, um, this one, and then finally this one. Unlock Ordinals, which is a whole new mechanic. And yes, I'm going to do it this episode. Because it's, I think I'm only like five minutes in this episode. I may be longer, but whatever. So, increment Ordinals. This is just Ordinal Markup. I need... Oh, it costs Unfunity. Okay, maybe I shouldn't... Do this, oh, actually, well, multiply on funny gain by 10. All I need is just a certain ordinal. There's also the li increase the limit of dimensional stabilizer to 20. What is even that? It is this one. Um, I don't think I even... I'm, I'm not even sure exactly how much that I should even do. Also, this apparently divides on funny by 10,000. Yes, it does. Weird. I just lost all my on funny. That's kind of unfair. I, I had all these upgrades. Or at least I had... Okay, whatever. I, I'm, I'm, at least I have this 10 times boost. I guess at this point, I should probably just get this. And this actually allows me to do this upgrade and get the Eternity Automation tier. I don't really... Actually, I'm, this may be nice. Um, I can actually do 
two of these, the Infinity Automation and Eternity Automation. I don't really need that. I, I mean, I guess I could do Infinity Automation and just set it to like every five minutes or something. So I'll do that. And I guess if I want, I could try to get Omega times five. This is Dimensional Compression, no longer resets antimatter Dimensions, and then the Axioms no longer reset on reality. That must, that must be the next prestige layer. I'm just going to need more unfunny to do this. And I really should actually just get some of these upgrades. Or maybe I'm okay with my current unfunny. But this is interesting. Um, but yeah, it's, it's an interesting mechanic. It's, um, it's definitely actually changing the game up a little bit. It's weird that this divides unfunny rather than... I mean, I guess... Unfunity can be exponential, but it's kind of weird saying it costs that much and then it divides it rather than the normal, which is subtracts it. I feel like I should just subtract it because I don't think it would have much change to the actual mechanic, and it would it would just be a lot better quality of life wise. So yeah, at least at least you have these upgrades. I unlocked the new mechanic. I could try I could try to get this upgrade. I'm actually pretty close to it at this point. Um, you can see I I can infinity for a decent amount of infinity points. I don't think it's... I'm not exactly sure how much it's going to give for anything out just like... or if, if it's going to give even more infinity points or turning points. I guess I could try to get some of these dimensions. Honestly, I'll just press M and that gets me everything up to the 7th um, eternity dimension. So that's actually pretty good. Um, with that and all these upgrades, I can. It looks like I am getting a lot of infinity points. It's not as much as before. Probably, I probably, I'm just gonna go up to a mega, a mega to five, and I guess I'll. What I'll do after that is I'll just get as a couple of these upgrades because they don't cost any infinity anymore, and then get the omega squared. So that's that's that sounds that sounds like a plan. I, I'm still. I still don't like how Unfunity regulates progression like this, though. Like it's just, it's very annoying. You have to be active to gain it, but I guess I can deal with it. It's it's a lot faster now. So here he is. Dimensional compression no longer resets entire dimension. That's gonna be really good because now look what happens when I do this. All I have to do is just buy all the dimensions back. That makes this about twice as twice as quick to get back to infinity. I, I, don't, I still don't know why it's not buying the dimensions one by one. Um, Reinhardt really needs to fix that. But at least it's an improvement from what I got before. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out. Mm -hmm.